Imagine someone that truly loves their work, okay? Imagine someone that really loves their job. Hold them in your mind for a second. Maybe they walk in and they're floating around, they're skipping down the hallway, they're so excited to be here, okay? Visualize them. <laughs> and what's one word that comes to mind? What's one word that you would use to describe someone that truly is madly in love with their job? Energy? Passion, motivated, passionate. Usually right about now, something else starts to come out. <laughs> What's that? Crazy. Crazy, yes, thank you. Crazy. Anybody else? Medicated, <laughs> yes. I often hear the term trust fund baby. <laughs> They're just skipping into work like this and you just like, they're like, oh my God, they have clearly OD'd on the medication. Or maybe they won the lottery. But we all know they'll, they'll be back soon, right? If, even if they win the lottery. So the trick here is, and I do this a lot with groups, is that whatever word comes to mind after you've thought about it for a couple minutes, typically reveals something about your own internal beliefs about work, the stuff that you learn. And oftentimes, if you like drill down in like a really psychological setting, I ask people, well, where did you have your first ideas where, what, about work? Where did you learn them? What's somebody that you learned them from? Or maybe you learned it from TV? What's that? Parents, parents? First boss, teachers, yeah? Anybody have a parent that came home at night exhausted and sat back in the Lazy Boy and fell asleep watching Hee Haw? <laughs> Yeah, it happens, right? And so the beautiful thing is, is we're not really trying to get into anything like really deep about what we're trying. All we're trying to is just start to uncover is where do our beliefs about work come from? And once you uncover what they are for you, you can start choosing some new ones.